going to finish off Turn About Samurai. Because I think we should. I, I, I missed streaming on Friday, so I should do this. And, um... Am I happy with my ability to hear my own computer? Or this thing? I don't know. <coughs> I'm unprepared. And by that I mean I finished the case before I did this. That was a close one, huh, Mia? Really? Too bad, I'm sorry I missed it. Huh? Maya! So, what happened? Well, I think we've got a pretty good idea who did it. Now all I need is motive and proof. Wow! Good going, Nick! Under the initial trial system, tomorrow is the last day we have. Initial trial? What's that? That's the new court system they introduced two or three years ago. They had so many cases in the system, they decided to speed up the whole process. So, under that system, trials have to end in... three days? Yeah, pretty much. Well, we've no time to waste. I don't get it, Maya. Why would Mr. Hammer steal the Steel Samurai costume? What? You mean Mr. Hammer was wearing the costume? Yeah. But Mr. Hammer was the victim, Nick. Why would he go to the trouble of stealing it? That's what we have to find out. What happened with the director's testimony? Well, it's pretty clear that the producer and the director were both in the trailer. Huh. Which means that the killer has to be one of them. Really? Why? Because the real scene of the crime was Studio 2, where that trailer is. What?! Talk to WP. WP powers, right? And that's exactly what we're going to do. So the detention center. I don't believe we visited it yesterday. Mr. Wright, you did very well again today. Thank you. Oh, thanks. Did your voice change? No, I don't think so. Okay. Uh, could you not look like you're about to burst into tears? Wow, Nick! You must have really wowed him in there. You could stop looking so... vulnerable, too. Hey, WP! Only one day left! Let's make it count! Yes. Though well, there's... not really anything I can do to help. <laughs> I'm not really sure what I can do, either. Please, this is no laughing matter. Could you tell me more about Miss Vasquez? Oh, the, the producer? She's well respected in the industry. They say she's a genius. A genius? She's been at Global Studios for five years now. Right or wrong, nobody dares to look different these days. Why's that? Well, ever since she came on board, we've had nothing but hits. Global well, Studios was on its knees, but she picked it up and made it shine. Oh, and... And... what? Nothing, forget it. I I've only heard rumors anyhow. Can you tell me anything about Mr. Manella? Oh, he used to be a minor straight to video director, but something in his work caught Vasquez's eye. She brought the Steel Samurai idea to him. Now everyone knows the name Salmonella. I hear he's pretty much at her beck and call, though. Whenever she says John P. S. how high and all that. I can imagine him being her beck and call, but I can't imagine him jumping. Uh, Nick, that was rude. He's kind of that bad, isn't he? How loud is this coming through? I don't know. <laughs> Uh, 
I was wondering about Mr. Hammer. He was a big star back in the day, right? But then he just dropped off the face of the Earth. Oh, yes, you're right. In fact, he was my role model when I started in this business. But he just stopped taking on big roles. That's when he began appearing in little productions of Global. How could he do that? I was really looking forward to a sequel to Samurai Summer. He just gave up being a star five years ago. Actually, now that I think about it, that was right when Miss Vasquez came to Global. Five years ago. Hmm. We can't ask him anything more, and I... We could present him a few things. But I don't think they'll reveal anything new. Here's that picture again. I is that really Jack Hammer inside the suit? He's the only one who it could have been. Why would he... Yeah! Why? You're in a medium, why don't you sum up Mr. Hammer's spirit and ask him yourself? <sighs> Give me about three more years. Look at us, the two novices. Regarding the murder weapon. Yes? Is it heavy, that spear? It's pretty hefty, yeah. I don't think an average person would be able to swing it around effectively. Hmm. And that's the spear that broke her stomach during the morning run through? Oh, yeah, I, I goofed up on a round kick, you see? I broke the spear. The security lady fixed it for me right away, though. With duct tape, we hurried. We could show him this, but... Or we could still. Uh, have you seen this, Mr. Powers? What's that? I've never seen you steal samurais in my life. These are the steel samurais that appear at live shows. A fan book, a fanboy collected all these pictures himself. Seeing things like this really makes me think. I mean, so much to these kids, you know? <laughs> okay. Okay, dear. Okay, beautiful, beautiful man. Um, are we gonna move? Are we gonna move now? Um, I'm gonna move to the studio. <laughs> the old windbag sure is quiet today. Quiet today. Quiet today. Words. You know, this place is really peaceful like this. Nick? I think her guard's down. Y yeah? I bet we could even eat those donuts in the guard station if we wanted. You eat, you die. <sighs> She's alive! <laughs> That's like my favorite. Um, I was wondering about Di Vasquez, the producer. Oh, the studio big licks love her. So, she always gets her way. She seems bitter. Do you not like the producer? Look, the studio people don't want me talking about her, so sorry. What was this old lady's voice again? I can't remember how to do it entirely, but I think it was somewhere around here. Can I ask you about Salmonella, the director? Sal? He's soft and pushover. Does whatever Vasquez tells him to. She treats him like dirt, but I think he likes it. Huh? Why would anybody like being treated like dirt? That doesn't make any sense, does it, Nick? Uh, no, no, it doesn't, Maya. <laughs> I just realized something, and I'm not gonna tell you what it is. About Mr. Hammer. Ah! I heard what you said today, cheeky whippersnapper! Poor old Hammer, you drag his star down from the sky and stomp on it! Calling him a criminal, a thief! I, 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 I won't forget this! Uh oh, she's really pissed this time. You listen to me, whippersnapper. My poor old Hammer would never do such a thing. Why would he steal Power's costume so he could sneak by me? He would never stoop so low, it's impossible! 
Okay, um... Let's, let's toddle off somewhere. Um... Let's go to, let's go to the, the studio place. Maybe. Let's try that. This is gonna be a long adventure section because I can't remember entirely what to do here. <laughs> like, that actually pretty much killed my DS playthrough, not remembering what to do on this day. Think back, Nick, to the day of the murder. Mr. Hammer put on the Steel Samurai costume, then he left from here to go to Studio 2. Right. But why? I wonder if someone called him, like the director or the producer. There's nothing here. Let's go here. Hey, Nick! It's Miss Vasquez! Hello? Hello! H-E-L-L! -L. Oh! M Maya, you should at least try to be polite! I'm watching the clouds. That's all she had to say, apparently. <coughs> uh, excuse me? Mr. Hammer came here on the day of the murder and... Shh. Hmm? Perhaps you didn't hear me. I'm watching the clouds. I'm not interested in talking to you. Do something, Nick! She's really taking me off! Oh, dear. <laughs> uh, Mr. Powers wasn't the killer. You don't have to cancel the Steel Samurai. I think I'm tired of the Steel Samurai. Y you did it! Nick, she did it! She's the killer! My fave blood speaks! My fave blood speaks to me! I know it! I know it! Oh, dear. Um, I was wondering if you could teach us how to read our lines correctly. I was wondering if you could tell me about Mr. Manella. If you must talk about that man, perhaps you could talk about it in the trailer. By yourselves. Oh, oh dear. She wants to go into the trailer. Should we do it? Or shall we examine the surroundings? I think I should just examine a few things. Like, um, take note of this. An incinerator. Apparently they just put this one in. It's already covered in soot. They must not clean it much. A light van for moving staff and equipment around. They've kept it in pretty good shape. Looks like it'd run fine. Well, let's go for a drive! Sure, if I had a license. Nick, you don't have a driver's license? But, look, I have this! Why are you showing me your attorney's badge, Nick? I'm pretty sure I've already read that out, but there's a better reading of it if you want it. <laughs> This is where Salmonella and De Vasquez ate. There's nothing left on the plates. Hey, so they ate T-bone steaks too. Something wrong? I, I don't know, I'm getting this funny feeling. Something about this just feels odd, you know? Can't say that I do. What happens if we move into the trailer? We get a date stamp. Wasn't the assistant cleaning up yesterday? Funny, it still seems pretty messy in here. I guess she was still on a high from getting that rare card she needed. Ah, nothing happens. Except for this cute discussion about Penny. Well, um... Let's go back to Studio 1. Oh, we can't go back to Studio One. Studio One's become completely irrelevant. We're gonna go back to the gate. And then we're gonna go to the detention center. No, we don't. I, I pressed entirely the wrong button, said the wrong thing, and everything just clicked together rather nicely in that moment. So, we're actually going is the employee area. Ah, 
I guess they're not filming today, either. I did want to see them filming just one time. This trial will be over and done by tomorrow. You can come see them film later. I guess. This is where you found that bottle of sleeping pills, right? Uh-huh. I wonder if there's any other clues lying around. Yeah! No, 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 no touching! How do I do your voice, pal? Somewhere around here. No touching! Ah! <laughs> Ow. Oh, sorry, pal. Didn't mean to frighten you. D didn't mean- I almost had a heart attack! <laughs> I- <laughs> I guess I can be a little bit dramatique at times. I suppose it's the actor in me. Dramatique, indeed. <clears throat> anyway, I'm here to examine the plate on the table. Wait, are you looking for sleeping pills? Yeah, pal. Traces thereof. 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 Accents. What is your voice? I can't remember. Some kind of action figure of thing. Dar. Dar, 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 dar. Ah, this is how you do a warm-up, kids. <laughs> anyway. So, you're looking for traces of the sleeping pills. How? For a thorough examination, I gotta take the plate down to the precinct. But I have the capabilities to make a cursory examination right here. Our science guy gave me some testing solution. This reacts to sleeping pills, see? If there are traces, it'll change color. Wow, neat! Wild Detective Gumshoe? Well, what are you waiting for? No, no, everything in due time, pal. Well, the testing solution on the plate changed color, alright. So, there were sleeping pills on the plate. Looks like it. How goes your investigation? To tell the truth, it's a real mess, pal. Some people think we should pursue the case we already have against Powers, and some people think we should switch suspects. Well, what do you think, Detective Gumshoe? Well, pal, I hate to admit it, but I'm not sure I bought a case against Mr. Powers anymore. I feel kind of bad for Mr. Edgeworth, though. How is Edgeworth doing, anyway? Edgeworth is out of control! He was in the waiting room, and he crushed this paper cup with hop, hop, coffee in it. I, I mixed my T's and P's up in there somewhere. Whoa. Talk about birds, pal! Wow, the fury of Edgeworth. Yeah, crushing paper cups. Cups. Bottles. Bottles? Say, whatever happened with that empty bottle? Oh, the bottle is leaving bills? Well, I got some good news for you about that. They found the victim Jackhammer's prints on the bottle. So that means... Yep, sounds like the one who put Paris to sleep was none other than the victim. So I was right. Okay, where do we go? Into here. Oh, hello. What are you doing here? Oh, I was just cleaning up the dressing room. I guess WP won't be using it anymore, so... What? What? Why? But WP's innocent! Yeah, and I'm really grateful for all that you've done, but... This week is the last episode of The Steel Samurai. What? No! I apologize if I put a DVD's ears out there. I did actually just overclock quite a lot. <laughs> Is that better? Is that better? That? Oh my god, I'm so loud. <laughs> I was wondering if I could ask you about Mr. Hammer. Yes? On the day of the murder, he went to Studio 2. Huh? I thought he went to Studio 1. He stole the Steel Samurai costume, too! What? Why would Mr. Hammer do something like that? Oh. I guess the rumor must be true, then. The rumor? 
Yeah, Miss Vasquez, that producer, had some kind of hold on Hammer. She had some dirt on him. He could do anything she said, apparently. Some dirt? What dirt? A dirt, you know. That stuff. Uh, I, I know what dirt means. About five years ago, they were filming a movie starring Mr. Hammer. They were using the new studio, Studio 2. Some sort of accident happened here. They left the film set the way it was too. The film set? Was that trailer part of the film set then? What do you mean, the last steel samurai? I know it's a shot, but nothing can be done to save it now. Whoever really did kill Mr. Hammer also saw the steel samurai's death warrant. No, no! Also, I hear that Film Studios is going to change its program. They're not going to make kids shows anymore. What? Why? I don't know. It's sad, but that's what the studios decided. Why aren't they going to make kids shows anymore? The studio bigwigs don't want to stay so around anymore. They want to forget all this ever happened. They want to be quiet, you understand? How can they just do that? What about all the kids who love to steal samurai? It's okay, I'm sure the kids will be fine. They'll find a meaning for the problem. No, that can't be true! If the program just ends, they'll be heartbroken for sure! Nick, say something! I... Yeah! I think evidence for our reports is called for here. Here, take a look at this. And this is? A fan collected all of these photographs. The kids love the Steel Samurai. The kids love the Pokemon with the Pokey and the man. <laughs> the show couldn't be cancelled just so some adults could save face. I would think you would understand that better than anyone. You're right. Okay! But what can I do? Well, for starters, you can tell me something. Tell me what it is that Global Studios is so intent on hiding. Tell me about this accident five years ago. Okay. Could you tell us what happened five years ago? I just asked that. Well, I can tell you what occurred. Apparently, five years ago, someone died and it was Hammer's fault. Someone died? It was an accident, of course. Anyway, the producer and Miss Vasquez managed to hush it up. And that's the dirt she had on Mr. Hammer. And that's why Mr. Hammer would do anything Miss Vasquez asked him to do. But it was an accident, right? Why didn't they just make it public? Well, you know Mr. Hammer was a big star back then. You were afraid about what would happen in his career if word got out. I see. You know who knows more about this? This old bag? She was here at the studios back then, you know? Thanks. We'll try asking her. If she'll talk. Please tell me I'm not loud anymore. I know I think I'm still loud. <laughs> we need to talk to a madame. What? You're still slinking around? If you like the place so much, why don't you take over for me? The old windbag doesn't look so good. Everybody's doing their darndest to get Hammer. Who do they think made Global Studios what it is today? Hammer! It's all due to Hammer! She's starting to froth at the mouth, Nick. Maybe we should keep a safe distance? Actually, I'm gonna move for a second. I'm gonna go back home. Let's see what is going on outside the window. It's a nice day outside. The hotel across the way is always full these days. There's the bell boy happily cleaning the room. Okay, I'm pretty sure I've read that out loud then. Because <laughs> the stuff that's going on outside the window will always change. 
change at least once per case. Okay? No. Who's best to her? Um. I wanted to ask you about five years ago. <gasps> Who told? Who did you hear that from? I. Huh? Nichols! Nichols? Nichols, Nick. Penny Nichols, that assistant we talked to. Oh, right. Anyway, we heard about the accident. It was during filming with Jack Hammer. He killed a man, didn't he? Whippersnapper! Dredging up dirt on someone's path like that, and have recently departed, no less. I suppose you think this is fun? No, I'm, I'm just doing my job to protect powers. And you claim that Hammer stole Power's costume! You expect me to believe that rubbish? Or do you have some kind of proof? Proof that Hammer stole Power's costume? Huh. I'm sorry, Miss Oldback, but I do have proof. I can prove that Mr. Hammer stole Mr. Power's costume. Take that! Here's my proof. What? What's a little empty bottle supposed to prove? It's a bottle of sleeping with Mr. Hammer's fingerprints on it. What does that prove? I, I'm sure old Hammer had some sleepless nights. Where's your proof that he used those pills on power? Powers. Powers. Bird noise. Take that! Mr. Powers ate a T-bone steak for lunch, correct? Well, yes, so... This is the plate that he used to eat that steak. There are traces of sleeping pill powder on the plate. <gasps> I see. Poor, poor Hammer. You did wrong, Hammer. Rest your soul. Miss Oldback? Okay. You win. I'll talk. I'm tired, see. Tired of holding it all in. Miss Oldback. You're right. Five years ago, there was an accident. A fatal accident. What's worse, a paparazzo took a photo of it. You see, paparazzo is a singular and paparazzo is a plural. Millions of people make this mistake. Us. And now we can. I can't yell take that though. I'm sorry. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Holy shit, what just happened? <laughs> you agree, that's that's the same lady. But apparently a bit more emphasized. And with her hair loose. She's, she's cute. She's a cute lady. Do 
She's not even looking. Where? What? Where did you get that? I... Well... Old bag. Old? She needs a security lady, Miss Old Bag, Nick. Right, anyway. Miss Vasquez. You hit this incident from the press, didn't you? And you used it to control Mr. Hammer. The wind. The... Huh? It's gotten stronger, don't you think? The wind. Your conversation interests me. Let's talk about it more inside the trailer. Nick! She went inside the trailer! Nobody has legs in the My Nice Tony Games, okay? In investigations, they do have legs. <laughs> in fact, the investigation games were apparently started because of an April Fool's joke which showed a screenshot with characters walking around crime scenes. <laughs> and then that spawned two games, one of which um, has not been officially translated into English, and you're going to have to find a fan patch on the internet, which is apparently really, really good. Anyway. <laughs> you came. Well, what was that you were talking about? Why is she so Miss Vasquez, you were using that accident. You were blackmailing Mr. Hammer so that you could control him. you. That's why he was doing pitch of heavy change. what it was, wasn't it? I mean, sure, it was an accident, but you used it to drag Mr. Hammer down from his rightful place as a star! all this about? You keep saying accident, accident. How are you so sure? What do you mean? Must I spell everything out for you? Think, what would it be if it wasn't an accident? <gasps> no. No way. You mean Mr. Hammer did it on purpose? That is what I mean. Oh shit, she turned around. Where's your proof? Can you prove it? <laughs> Just <laughs> said it was an accident? Oh, well, she was a big Disneyland? So long, friends. 
Boys, erase away. No! Hold it right there! I heard everything, pal. T Vasquez, you are coming down to the precinct with me now! Okay, pal. Sorry, I was a little late with my entrance. I don't have any chances to practice that sort of thing. Thank you, thank you, thank you! I was really scared! Huh? Don't mention it, pal. Vasquez. God. 